This plant here will grow bushy red flowers. And this plant here will grow itsy bitsy blue flowers. Hmm. What about that plant? Ah. A trumpet flower! Good choice, Jojo. This daffodil plant will grow a yellow flower. Thanks, Jared. Thank you, Jared. Make sure you take good care of it. Hi, Cynthia. Hello, Cynthia. Oh, good morning, Jojo, Gran Gran. Oh, what have you got there? Jared gave it to me. I'm going to grow my own flower. How lovely! A daffodil too! Just like my flowers. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> my flower look like yours, Cynthia. Well, if you take good care of it, I'm sure it will. Maybe Cynthia can give you some flower growing tips. Of course. It's very simple, really. A plant needs lots of sunlight to grow. And plenty of water. And if you take good care of it, you'll soon have a yellow daffodil flower. Just like yours? Just like mine. Thanks, Cynthia. We'll take good care of this plant. Won't we, Panda? Shall we try again? Tap, 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 slide and turn. Whoa! Oof. Why does it look so easy when you do it, Gran Gran? <laughs> it wasn't always easy. Just ask Great Gran Gran. Jojo, my little sunshine. How lovely to see you. What are you up to today? Hello, Great Grand Grand. I'm learning dance moves from the Moolah La. Oh, yes, 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 yes. <laughs> it's tricky. Hmm. Well, it can take time to learn new dance moves, Jojo. That's what Grand Grand said. <laughs> That's because Grand Grand learned her moves from me. Gran Gran used to find the Moolah La moves tricky too. She had to learn them bit by bit. Bit by bit. So, don't give up, Jojo. When you're ready, I'd love to see you dance. We can make a show of it. Oh, I can't wait. Oh, shoo, my boy. I'll see you later on. Bye. Bye, Gran Gran. See you later. Bye. Let's dance. Tap, tap, tap. Tap, tap, tap. Tap, 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 slide. Tap, 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 slide. Tap, 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 slide. Got it! <laughs> tap, 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 slide. Yes! Now! The last move, the turn. Panda. 
Panda. Gran, Gran. Oh, Jojo, why aren't you in bed? <sighs> Me and Panda want to see the full moon, like the one in your picture. But we think it's hiding somewhere. Oh, the full moon isn't hiding, Jojo. Come on, I'll show you. The moon is a ball shape, but we can only see the part which the sun lights up. Sometimes we can only see a little bit of the moon. And sometimes we can see a lot of the moon. <gasps> so when we see the moon in the sky, it can look like lots of different shapes. But it's still the same moon. And all the shapes have names. This shape is called a crescent moon. This shape is called a half moon. And this shape is called... The full moon. You've got it. Now, good night, Jojo. It was a spring morning. The blossom was on the trees. The sun was peeking through the clouds. And Jojo and Gran Gran, that's me, were playing on the swings in the park. That's it, Jojo. You've got it. Whee <laughs> I'm going as high as the clouds, Gran Gran. <laughs> Whee! You have to keep your feet, Panda, like this. <laughs> Oh, I think it's going to rain. Oh, and I haven't brought my umbrella. Aww. Oh, it's time to get a wiggle on, Jojo. Race you to the bandstand. Come on, Panda. <laughs> We still have to check the weather forecast, Gran Gran. Oh, hopefully it won't rain for long. I can already see the sun peeking through the clouds. <gasps> Look, Gran Gran. It's a rainbow! The flowers in your kitchen are all droopy, Gran Gran. <laughs> it's called wilting, Jojo. That's what happens to flowers over time. It means it's time to pop them in the compost bin. Eventually, these old flowers will turn into compost and we use compost in the garden to help new flowers grow. Ah! I hope our roses don't wilt, Gran Gran. I want to keep them forever. Oh, flowers don't last forever, Jojo. Even roses. Hmm. But if we keep them watered and take good care of them, They'll stay like this for a week or so, giving us plenty of time to admire them. Gran Gran, you forgot one! Ah, that's because there is one way to stop flowers from wilting. Jojo, I think it's time for a Gran Gran plan. <laughs> I'm going to show you how to press a flower. Press a flower? <laughs> it means pressing it flat with something heavy and leaving it to dry out. First, we're going to need some books. Oh, what about my Captain Chloe book, Gran Gran? It's very good. Hmm, we can use that to hold the flower and then we need some thick, heavy books to press down on it. <laughs> What about this book? Oh, that looks heavy enough to me. Can you see any more? Hmm, yes. No, no, and yes. <laughs> wow. Look, Panda.
Come and get your fresh fish. Hello, Navid. Gran Gran, how are you? <laughs> Good, thanks. And you? Oh, you know me, Gran Gran, keeping busy selling fish. <laughs> and this here must be Jojo. Hello, Navid. Oh, it's a bit cold here. That'll be the ice. It keeps the fish fresh. Ooh. This is my most popular fish, Jojo. That's why I like to get here early, before it's sold out. Is it the usual, Gran Gran? Four fresh fish, please. Cleaned and scaled. Oh, and before I forget, I've got something for you, too. Oh, banana bread? Isn't your Gran Gran the best, Jojo? <laughs> Huh. <laughs> <Whoa>. <laughs> Hello, Monty. Sorry, Jojo. Hi, Gran Gran. Down, Monty. We're looking for the pet stall. Monty needs a new ball. He lost the old one in the park. We can help you find the pet stall. Oh, thanks, Jojo. If that's OK, Gran Gran. Naveed, we'll be back in a minute. It was a windy autumn day. The leaves were changing colour and falling from the trees. And Jojo and Gran Gran, that's me, were looking for a new Captain Chloe book in the library. How about Captain Chloe in Space? We've read that one lots and lots. Captain Chloe in the Jungle. <clears throat> the Dinosaur? No, thank you. Hello, Jojo. Gran Gran? Hello, Hello Terence. Terence. What are you looking for today? Are there any Captain Chloe books about pandas? Uh, I don't think so. But I'm sure we have some other books about pandas in the library. This is a book of panda facts. Hmm. Will there ever be a Captain Chloe book about pandas? <laughs> I think you'd need to ask the author. What's an author? An author is somebody who writes books. Like this book? Mm-hmm. And that book? Uh-huh. Every book in the library was written by an author. Wow. That must have taken a long time, Panda. Jojo, that gives me an idea for a Gran Gran plan. If you can't find a Captain Chloe book about pandas, you can write one yourself. <gasps> I can write my own book? Of course. You can be Jojo the author. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, it stopped raining. Isaiah, do you want to play outside? We can splash in the puddles. Hmm. Can we play inside? My science book has lots of fun things to do. But I want to go outside and splash in puddles. It's really fun. But I want to stay inside and do some science. It sounds like we need to find a compromise. Huh? What's a compromise? A compromise is when two people who want to do different things find a way to get a bit of what they both want. Hmm. I think it's time for a grand grand plan. We can do some science. Yay! About puddles! Woohoo! <laughs> <laughs> I like compromise. Me too. I think that's the biggest puddle I've ever seen. It's huge. <gasps> this is a good puddle for some outdoor science. Now it's stopped raining, how do you think this puddle might change? Um, Panda thinks it will stay like this forever. I don't think it will get any bigger. Let's find out. Here, grab a piece of chalk. Can you draw around the puddle? Yes! OK. <laughs> <laughs> right, here goes. Let's see if the puddle changes. This is the first stop on our sensory safari. And it's all about what we can smell. Mm. These 
flowers smell very nice. <sighs> oh, they do. What's the next stop on our safari, Gren Gren? At the next stop, it's all about what sounds we can hear. Hi, Cynthia! Hiya! Oh, hello, Jojo! Grand Grand? We're on a sensory safari. Oh, exciting! And we're using our ears to listen for sounds. There are lots of sounds in the community garden. Ooh. <gasps> I can hear something. Wow. It's a squirrel. <laughs> ah, what else can you hear, Jojo? I can hear... Something else. Oh, it's a bird. You heard a sparrow. Keep, keep, keep. Bye, sparrow. Now we're going to look for things we can feel and see. We didn't get to the bus stop in time. Other people will be waiting for the bus along the road. The bus can't be late for them. Oh, it's a very busy bus, Panda. Ah, oh, missed it. Jared! Hey, Jojo! Grand Grand! Guess we'll be getting the next bus together. When will the next bus be here? Let's check the timetable. The timetable tells us the different times the buses are going to arrive. And we need the number seven, which will be here any minute now. Yay! <laughs> oh, dear. I think the bus is too full for all three of us to get on. Oh, I'm going to be late getting back to the shop. I hope there aren't any customers waiting. You get on this bus, Jared. We'll wait for the next one. What if the next bus is too full, Grand Grand? Oh, I'm sure the next bus will have space. On you get, Jared. Oh, thanks, Grand Grand. You're a legend. Oh, uh, sorry. See you later. Bye. <laughs> Don't worry, Jojo. I'm sure the next bus will be here soon. It's the next bus! Hooray! It's here! Quick, Grand Grand! Oh, that was quick. 30 minutes starts... Now! Grand Grand? Is 30 minutes nearly gone? <laughs> oh, dear. I'm afraid not. There's still a long time to go. We have to wait so long. And the banana bread smells so nice. And I would really, really like to taste it. It might feel like a long time to wait, Jojo. But we can make the time fly if we keep busy. And luckily, we've got two more jobs to do. First, we need to make a tasty topping for the banana bread. Lemon icing. It's my own secret recipe. Careful, Jojo. Lemons on their own are a bit... Ooh, sour. <laughs> longer 
till our banana bread is ready, Grand Grand. Uh, we still have 15 minutes to go. But that's ages. We need to make the time fly, don't we, Panda? Whee! <laughs> I have one more job for us to do to make the time fly. Washing up. That was fun. Mmm. Oh. <laughs> See, 30 minutes has flown by. If we pop this stick next to your plant, we can measure how much it has grown. And if we draw a new line every week, we can see how much your plant is growing. I will keep looking after it, just like Cynthia said. Jojo, it looks just like a trumpet. And you must have been taking really good care of it, too. <laughs> what are you drawing, Jojo? It's a menu for my own cafe. Oh, is that me? Yes, you're the chef. It's called Jojo and Grand Grand's Cafe, and it's very special because it sells solution food. There's macaroni pie, panda's favorite, kalali soup, fried plantain, and bakes. Jojo, I think it's time for a grand grand plan. We can use your menu to open our own cafe at home. We're ready to open. Welcome to Jojo and Grand Grand's Cafe. Can I take your order, please? Jojo, I think we've forgotten something. The menu! Here you are, Panda. There you go, Hugo. What can I get for you? Mm-hmm. Yes. Of course. And for you, Hugo? Mm hmm Good choice. I'll tell the chef. <laughs> <laughs> chef Grand Grand! Hey, Cynthia! Hello, Great Grand Grand! Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Jojo and Grand Grand's Puppet Show! <laughs> it's called The Lion Who Lost. His roar. Oh, I'm on the edge of my seat. Once upon a time, there was a lion who lost his roar. 
So the lion decided to ask his friends. Elephant, I'm looking for my roar. Have you seen it? Your roar? Oh, no. I'm sorry, lion. Elephants only go... <laughs> Very good, Gran Gran. Crocodile, have you seen my roar? Your roar? Oh, no. I'm sorry, lion. Crocodiles only go snap, snap, snap. Jojo and Gran Gran must have done a lot of practising. Shush, Gerard. I want to hear what happens next. Sorry, great Gran Gran. Finally, the lion asked his friend, Dinosaur. Dinosaur, I've lost my roar. Have you seen it? Your roar? Of course. I'm a dinosaur. Try doing this. Chin up, chest out, then roar. Chin up, chest out, roar! I did it! I found my roar! Thank you, dinosaur. And the lion never lost his roar again. <laughs> All these leaves look orange, Gran Gran. Ah, from a distance they do, Jojo. But look closely. Whoa! Orange, red, yellow and green. Oh, that's why autumn is my favourite time of year. I love how colourful the trees look. We need an orange leaf first. How can we collect the orange leaf all the way up there, Gran Gran? It's too high. We can't collect leaves that haven't fallen from the trees yet, Jojo. Then how will we collect any leaves for our nature tick book? Huh? Jared! Oh, hey, Jojo! Gran Gran! I wish these trees would stop dropping their leaves everywhere. As soon as I sweep them up, more fall. Huh? <laughs> We're going to collect leaves in all different colours to finish our nature tick book. But we can't collect leaves that haven't fallen from the trees yet. But you can collect leaves that have fallen, right? Mm-hmm. How about this leaf? An orange leaf! It looks just like the orange leaf in my nature tip book. Thanks, Jared! Come on, Jojo. Let's get to the park. We have lots of other colourful leaves to find. Bye, Jared! See you later, Jared. Bye! <laughs> Don't get too comfy, Gran Gran. We've got a job for you. Every game of football needs a referee. Oh, say no more, Jared. I used to referee your dad's football games. Gran Gran, what's a referee? A referee is in charge of the game and tells you when it's time to start and stop playing. We play a timed game with two halves, otherwise we'd go on for hours. <laughs> we are the robots. Here come the robots. Hello, Rocket. Ready to lose that trophy to the robots? <laughs> <laughs> Not a chance, Ezra. Not with super skilled Cynthia on the pitch. Ah! You better watch out too, Terence. We have a new star player. Hi, Ezra. Hi, Terence. Oh, hello, Jojo. Well, we robots have our own star player too. My grandson, Jackson. Hello, I'm Jackson and this is Rabbit. Rabbit can sit next to Panda, if you want. Rabbit watches me play all the time. All the time. Everybody ready to start the football game? Ready! ready! I'll be our goalie. Let's play football! <laughs> yeah! Go, Jojo! Give it a good kick! <laughs> Goal, Jojo, and I'll pass it over. Oh, that 
That's OK, Jojo. There's still lots of time to score our first goal. <laughs> Grand Grand? Of course. What kind of music would you like to listen to? Um... This music. This music. <laughs> or this music. This music is called jazz. It reminds me of when I used to make my own music with my band. You used to make your own music? Yes. Come on, I'll show you. My band were called the Boogie Bops. <laughs> because we made you boogie and we made you bop. <laughs> That's me on the saxophone. Ezra on the double bass. And that is your granddad on the drums. Was granddad good on the drums? Oh, he was amazing, Jojo. He could play slow. And he could play fast. Wow. I wish I could play the drums like Grandad. Hmm. That gives me an idea for a grand grand plan. <laughs> oh. There. Now you have your own drum kit. There's the receptionist. Hello. We're here to check in for an appointment for Jojo. And Panda. Hello, Jojo. Hello, Panda. Let me have a look. Oh, yeah. There you are. All checked in. Thank you. Please take a seat in the waiting area and I'll call your name when the dentist is ready to see you. It won't be too long. Excuse me. What special sticker does the dentist have today, please? It was a dinosaur last time. <laughs> well, the dentist likes to keep her stickers a surprise. Even I don't know what they are. <laughs> Hello. Can I check in, please? It's Cynthia. Thank you. Cynthia! Oh, hello, Jojo. Hi, Gran Gran. What happened, Cynthia? Oh, I've got a really sore tooth. I hope I don't have to wait too long to see the dentist. We're waiting to see the dentist too. Would you like to sit with us? I'm going to brush Panda's teeth so they're clean and fresh. Wonderful. First, we need to get our toothbrush. Then, we'll need some toothpaste. Now I have to brush Panda's teeth for two minutes. Gran Gran, we need the timer. Two minutes starting now. Brush, brush, brush. It's important to brush on the outside of the teeth and the inside. Mm -hmm. That's what Mummy says. Brush, brush, brush. The toothpaste is nice and minty, isn't it, Panda? Brush, brush, brush. Finished. Clean and fresh. Nafid, how old is baby Akil? He's seven months old, but he's getting bigger every time I look at him. Aren't you, little man? <laughs> I remember when you were seven months old, Jojo. You used to chat away just like that. <laughs> Did I really? <laughs> Look, Akil. Meet Panda. <gasps> What's wrong? Oh, nothing's wrong, Jojo. Crying is one of the ways Akil lets me know he needs something. And right now, oh, I think he's telling me he needs something to eat. Oh, 
Oh, a keel loves sweet potato, don't you? It's a bit smushy. <laughs> oh, and it can get a bit messy. <laughs> Did I eat smushy food when I was a baby, Gran Gran? You loved soft pasta shells, which were a little bit less orange. Oh, it was lovely to see you, Naveed, and baby Akeel. We're off to the park now. Oh, we're going to the park too. Would Akeel like to see the playground? I think that means yes, Jojo. Great! Happy Diwali, everyone. It's time to make our rangoli. What's that? They're colourful patterns. I'll show you. <laughs> Yay! First, we need our powder paint colours. We lay out the stencil to make our pattern. Then we pour the paints onto the stencil. It's not a carnival without delicious food. What can we have at our carnival? For our carnival, I think we can have scrumptious soursop juice. Made soursop juice. It's time to make carnival decorations. Okay. Gran Gran, we can't make carnival decorations. We used everything for our invitations. Hmm. I know where to go. Jared! Hi, Jared! Hey, Jojo! Gran Gran! I'm looking forward to your carnival later. <laughs> but we still need to make some decorations. You do? Well, how about some carnival flags? Those aren't flags, Jared. They aren't flags yet. But what if I do this? Ta-da! Yay! How wonderful! 
waterfall. Thanks, Jared. Oh, thanks, Jared. See you later. It was a cold winter morning. The trees were bare and the air was frosty. And Jojo and Gran Gran, that's me, were in the park. Robin Jojo. <gasps> Robins are my favourite birds, Gran Gran. I really like their red tummies. Ooh. <gasps> <laughs> Bye, Robin! What's your favourite bird, Gran Gran? Hmm. My favourite birds are swallows. I've never seen a swallow before, Gran Gran. Oh, they're beautiful, Jojo. And you know you've spotted one if you see its forked tail. See? Let's try and spot a swallow panda. Gran Gran. I've looked in the sky, I've looked in the trees, I've even looked over the bridge. Oh, we won't see a swallow today, Jojo, because they all fly away in the winter. Gran Gran, is there a panda constellation? Oh, I'm not sure, but there are two bears. Really? This constellation is called the Plough. <laughs> it looks like a saucepan. Yes. It makes part of a constellation called Ursa Major, the Great Bear. Wow! Now, if we turn the view this way... And who's this? Well, this is a constellation called Ursa Minor, the Little Bear. <laughs> It's a bit like a little panda. Yes. Maybe there is a panda constellation somewhere. Maybe there is. Great Gran Gran! Jojo, my little sunshine. How lovely to see you. I heard you're having a sleepover at Gran Gran's. Yes. And we're looking at constellations. Ooh, I love stargazing. Why are there no stars behind you, Great Gran Gran? <laughs> it's still daytime in St. Lucia, Jojo. But when it's night time, Great Gran Gran will be able to see lots of stars. Will they be the same stars that we see? Some will be. Wherever we are in the world, we share the same sky. But sometimes we can see different stars. Whoa. <laughs> I think I'll go stargazing tonight. And when I do, I'll think of you, Jojo, asleep under the same sky. Have a beautiful night, you two. Oh, bye, bye Mama. Bye, Gran Gran. Jojo and Gran.